For years, we've been fascinated with robots. Meet Mr. Machine, a wind-up robot released in 1960 that you can take apart to see the gears and put back together again, giving all young engineers everywhere some youthful inspiration. Machine. Mr. Machine. He talks. No, he squawks as he walks. Next was the Robot Commando, a toy bot that hinted at the technology to come. He had a remote control that, get this, was able to perform voice commands, making Robot Commando one of the more sophisticated toys of that time. Robot Commando fires his secret weapon. He takes orders from no one except you. Now, robots like these are collectibles. Following the blockbuster success of Star Wars in the 70s, toy robots rose in popularity and availability. Many wanted their own R2-D2. The Tommy line became well known for making toy robots for children. Then came the 1980s and the Omnibot was born. Not only did this toy robot's control panel play cassette tapes, remember those, it also acted as a microphone. By the 1990s, the new Rad robot was able to shoot toy missiles and feature wireless remote control, an upgrade from Omnibot. But before Rad and Omnibot, there were other toy robots that caused a lot of excitement, but they were less technical and a little simpler. Toy robots have continued to be a hit in the market today for kids and some of our adults who are kids at heart. Let's make the move from the past with toy robots and into the future of workstations. Ethel's up next on location at the Consumer Electronics Show. She met with the innovators at NovelQuest Enterprises, a Quebec company that has constructed a truly stylish and efficient computer workstation. See why they call it the ruler of all workstations right here on Gadget Girls. the ultimate workstation which not only lets you do all your work gaming watch the movies but it's also ergonomic and very comfortable yes this is the Emperor 1510 the name comes from the Emperor Scorpion because this is like the tail of the scorpion over here so to get into the Emperor the uh, monitors lift and once inside we lower the uh, the monitors just at the right uh, right height and right distance from the user that's amazing so can I move the chair at all, though? Uh, yes. The, uh, for comfort, you can uh, tilt the, uh, the whole machine backwards. Well, so you can have a position it's like a ride like as I like do here. work. <laughs> and the machine has an integrated audio system, three monitors. We can go all the way to six monitors. Uh, you have the webcam for teleconferencing. You have the working lights. So you have all the different components that you would have in a regular office, but uh, integrated into one machine. The, uh, the metal frame we can have in almost any color, so it's customizable to a large extent. Where would I put my PC or uh, the a MacBook? The PC would be on the side here. You can have a PC or a Mac. Uh, we don't, do not include the, uh, the PC, so the person would, would use their own PC. And, uh, but the, uh, the monitors, the, the machine, the seat, all is included. This is the ultimate workstation, and I think also a home entertainment system. I love my job. Patrick? When can I get one delivered? <laughs> you can take this one home. Well, that wraps up another jam-packed, exciting show. Backwards and threes from 100. That's what I was doing in French. Oh, <laughs> oh nice. Oh, sorry. <laughs>